And it's Mark from Narragansett Beer with our weekly stories. I'm here with uh, Matt Poison Medeiros. He's our uh, promotion guy and uh, band. What do you play in the band? I'm the bass. You're the bass guitarist. Bass guitar. Keep me conscious. Yeah. You might want to check Thank them you. out. But anyway, Matt, why don't you go with your story first? We got a great story coming from Jim, who we met a few weeks back at the Great Lost Bear in Portland, Maine. There will always be a special place in my heart for Narragansett. But as strange as it sounds, it has nothing to do with the beer. I was only 14 years of age when the story I'm about to tell you took place. The first big concert that I ever attended was presented by Narragansett Brewing Company at the Springfield Municipal Auditorium in my hometown of Springfield, Massachusetts. And on November 26, 1969, Janis Joplin and the Cosmic Blues Band, the same band that she took with her to Woodstock a few months earlier, when the house lights went down that November, that November evening and the stage lights came on, Janis walked on the stage, greeting the crowd with a big smile, raised, glistening, fancy glass bottom mug that she said was given to her by Narragansett Beer. She looked so joyous and happy. Her mood for the entire evening reflected just that. I've seen literally hundreds of concerts since then, but that Janice show tops them all. I remember like it was yesterday. I had the privilege of hearing her sing many of her classics that night, which I was unfamiliar with. She sang, danced, talked, laughed, and joked, and appeared to be completely loving every moment of it. I miss her terribly. However, I will always be grateful to Narragansett Beer for giving me the opportunity to see Janice that night. I will never, ever forget it. Thank you, Jim. That touched both our hearts. So. <laughs> You're a pretty good storyteller. <laughs> Here's to you. Hold well, on. So I've got a story here from uh, Barry in Vermont. Mark, nice work getting Ganson into northern Vermont. I buy Tall Boys at Lantman's IGA in Hinesburg. Thanks to all the pals at uh, Lantman's for bringing it in. I made my wife get a store clerk to go in the back and get me a six-pack when she called and said she could not locate Gansett in the beer cooler recently. I sat there by phone and described the colors of the Gansett cans and the branding on the can, and when she still couldn't locate it, I insisted she call in the pros. She said it was quite a scene in the small grocery store, people searching everywhere and asking questions, and then the victorious cry from the back, here you go. I found the Gansett. Neighbors in Vermont drink Gansett. Thanks for bringing it back. Barry, thanks for your story. we got t-shirts coming your way. And remember... And to Jim. And to Jim. You can always send us your story, and if we pick your story, you can get a t-shirt, and uh, we'd love to tell the story back to uh, all in New England and everyone else who's on our website. Cheers. Hi, neighbor. Have a good Gansett.